Hi guys, good morning. My name is Venkat, having six plus years of experience in IT industry and worked on Wipro, Infosys, l &T. These are all the companies I worked on. And uh, coming to the demo session, our course name is course name is Looker BA with SQL Server. Looker BA with SQL Server Database. Looker BA with SQL Server Database. Any idea? Here I mentioned like Looker BA. Okay, leave it Looker and BA. Anybody have any idea what is BA? Any idea what is BA? BI stands for business intelligence. BI stands for business intelligence. Means what will be the business related data is there? What will be the business related data is there that we need to analyze? And uh, on top of that data, we need to create some reports with the help of BI tools like Looker BI tool and then we will share those reports to the end users. End users can able to see those reports and uh, can able to take the business decisions to improve their business, to improve their business. For that particular purpose, these BI tools came into the market, like a local BI tool, like local BI tool, okay? So that will be the local BI tool, okay? And uh, this Looker BI tool also we can call uh, that name analytics tool. Analytics or reporting tool. Reporting to analytics tool or reporting tool are related to related to data. So just now also I said right. As to we need to analyze the data. On top of data, we will create the reports. We will create the reports. Analytics or reporting tools are related to a data only. We will analyze the data and then we will create the reports on top of data. On top of data, we can able to create the reports by using like a local BI tool, by using business intelligence tools. Business intelligence tool. Now coming to the some other technologies also there in the market like uh, full stack development. Full stack development tools are there in the market like uh, our full stack development technologies are there. Like uh, any idea what are all the full stack development technologies are there? Full stack development technologies. Full stack development. Like Java. Like Java. Yes, Java, .NET, Python. So these are all the full stack development technologies having 100% code is there here. 100% code is there here. You all are also aware about that coding things are very difficult to work also. Okay, coding things are very difficult to work. Okay, here full stack development technologies are completely 100 percentage of code will be there so daily basis learning and writing code will be the very very difficult to learn this full stack development technologies full stack development technologies but uh, coming to the bi tools coming to the bi tools like power bi or looker bi tools looker bi tools here there is no coding here these tools are drag and drop only. We will use a drag and drop. We will use. So these tools are drag and drop only. These tools are drag and drop only. Very simply, we can able to develop the reports. We can able to simply develop the reports. So here, no coding. So no coding. These are all the no coding technologies like BI tools are no coding technologies. These are all the drag and drop tools only. So no need to learn programming languages like Java, .NET, Python. 
this type of things we no need to learn all those things these uh, ba tools like looker bi tool is a uh, uh, drag and drop only see very simply we can able to drag and drop uh, and we can able to create the reports there is no coding there is no coding i am asking one question on top of what we will create the reports on top of what only we will create the reports excel database exactly madhu we will database. create the reports on top of data database means we will store the data in the database on top of data only we will create the reports okay for data purpose for data purpose we need to learn we need to learn sql server database SQL Server database we need to learn for data related part we need to learn SQL Server database maybe everybody also aware about SQL SQL okay in our degrees B Tech M Tech also came that SQL part okay SQL also very simple we have very few commands are there with the help of those commands we can able to work with this Docker BI tool we can able to create the reports very easily very easily okay and the next thing will be who are eligible to learn this docker bi tool who are eligible to learn docker bi tool who are eligible to learn docker bi tool if you have minimum one degree is there if you have minimum 1 degree if you have minimum 1 degree like that will be the 1 plus 2 plus either 3s degree like be btech me mtech mca bcom bsc any degree is there 10 plus 2 plus 3 okay either 3s degree or 4s degree 5s degree any people are also eligible to learn this looker bi tool and also some people will tell like sir i completed my graduation is a bcom i am not aware about any uh, software technologies completely zero knowledge is there so you are also welcome to learn the looker bi tool because in this class duration level in this class duration level in the course duration level from the scratch or from basics from basics onwards from basics onwards we will from basics onwards we will discuss the classes if you have some basic knowledge is there on top of sql or something no need to worry simply forget about that knowledge also from the basics onwards we will start uh, discussing the classes very easily from basics to advanced concepts we will discuss in the classes so easily you can able to learn and you can able to get the job very easily on top of looker bi technology on top of looker bi technology okay so now understand right for example some people will tell like sir i have completed uh, my degree in the year 2015 am i eligible to learn looker bi is the answer is yes sir, sir i am working uh, some bpo i am working from past 3 years onwards i am working in bpo so am i eligible to learn looker bi is the answer is yes only if you have minimum one degree is there then you are eligible to learn the you are eligible to enter into it industry as well as you are eligible to learn looker bi and you can able to get the job very easily okay you can able to get the job very easily so you can able to get the job very easily on top of looker bi technology okay looker bi technology so i am asking one more question here we will create the reports on top of data we will create the reports on top of data right so where we will store the data where we need to store the data where we need to store the data data warehouse so data warehouse correct any other answers for example data warehouse cloud 
cloud data warehouse. So cloud cast and data warehouse cast is minimum 20,000, 30,000 is there. For example, here in this session, total 12 members are there. I need to store that 12 members information like name, phone number, email ID. These are all the information I need to store. So do I need to go for a data warehouse for that one? For storing 12 members information? Do I need to go for that? No. So then where I need to store that 12 members information? Text file or Excel sheet. Exactly, Hemanta. We can able to store either text file, like what I am typing right now, that is the notepad file. Here also we can able to use, or we can able to use the Excel file for storing the data. So we are storing the files or databases or data warehouse that is completely depending on what? So I need to go for Excel or I need to go for flat file. I need to go for database. That is the completely depending on what case? Any idea? Size of the data. Exactly, size of the data. If large amount of data we need to store, then we need to go for databases or cloud applications. If we have very less amount of data is there, then we will go for files like uh, uh, notepad file, Excel file, like that we will go, okay? Like that we will go, okay? So for that cases also, where we will store the data. where we will store the data. It is completely depending on, it is completely depending on, that will be the uh, data storage, okay? First one is, for example, I have data is there, that data, I that data I have MBs is there. Per day transactions are, hundreds of transactions are going on. So what is the best choice need to go for, uh, um, for storing the data? Per day 100 transactions only I need to store. What is the best choice? Per day, 100 people's information I need to store. What is the best place for storing the data, 100 people's information? 100 easily we can able to store in Excel, right? So Excel for storing and for processing purpose also, we will use Excel only, for Excel only we can able to use for storing as well as for processing. If you want to store the data in GBs of data, for example, lakhs of transactions are happening per day. Lakhs of transactions are happening per day. In that cases, we will go SQL or databases we need to go for, for storing and uh, for processing purpose, for processing purpose, we need to use the programming languages we need to use. Programming languages we need to use like Java. Java. Python. So like this type of technologies we need to go for, like this type of technologies we need to go for are processing the data. For processing the data, we need to go for Java, Python, .NET, that type of technologies we need to go for. And uh, for storing purpose, we need to use the databases. We need to use the databases. Still, if you have large amount of data is there, like TBs of data is there, per day, millions of transactions are happening then for storing purpose, for storing purpose, we need to use a data warehouse. We need to use the data warehouse. Anybody tell me what is mean by warehouse? General meaning, what is warehouse? What is mean by warehouse? Guys, I'm asking general question only. What is mean by data warehouse? Cold storage warehouse is there, a rice warehouse is there. What is mean by warehouse? What is mean by godown? Godown, godown. It is a place where we can able to store 
bulk amount of things okay for example rice mill is there there also we have one uh, uh, warehouse is there rice warehouse is there or else rice godown is there there we can able to store large amount of things anything also large amount of thing we can store similarly here also warehouse means data warehouse means here we can able to store large amount of data we can able to store large amount of data for that particular purpose we will use for storing purpose we will use the data warehouse and uh, for processing purpose for processing purpose we will use bi tools like uh, looker bi we will use the bi tools like looker bi for processing the large amount of data for creating the reports we will use the bi tools like looker bi power bi like that tools are there in the market with the help of those tools we can able to create the reports and we can able to handle large amount of data we can able to handle large amount of data so for that particular purpose we have these many uh, skills or technologies will be there okay and uh, if you want to understand the complete application architecture i will show one diagram then you can able to understand very clearly so uh, everybody are you able to see the diagram here yes yeah fine so in any application also any any project real time project application we have um front end technologies are there front end technologies are there like html css javascript react js like that we have different different front end technologies are there with the help of front end technologies we can able to we can able to um design the web pages okay for example registration form in html like that i am taking and uh, now whenever we will click on whenever we will enter name email id password gender all those things whenever we will click on register automatically this complete data will store into database level it will store the data into data warehouse level observe here whenever we will click on with the help of front end technologies whenever we will click on okay button automatically complete data will store into complete data will store into database level in the market also we have different different databases are there like sql server oracle mongodb db2 postgresql azure big data like that different different databases are there okay so whenever we will click on button automatically data will store into database level there is a back end some logic is implemented with the help of with the help of programming languages like c c++ java python dotnet with the help of these programming languages some logic is implemented based on that logic data will store into database level data will store into database level once the data will store into database level two steps will start two steps will start those will be the first one is etl process and second one is reporting process reporting process etl process means etl stands for extraction transformation and loading here i wrote observe here etl stands for extraction transformation and loading okay in this etl procedure we will extract the data from multiple data sources and uh, with the help of etl tool the market also we have many etl tools are there out of that one popular etl tools are like informatica ssis talent odi data stage these are all some tools are available with the help of those tools we can able to clean the data we can able to clean the data finally we will load the data to data warehouse this a data warehouse also one type of database only but uh, high level configurations are there like more ram and more rom will be there in case of data warehouse once the data will store into data warehouse then with the help of reporting tool like power bi looker bi sap bo with the help of these tools we can able to connect to particular data warehouse and then 
we can able to create the reports we can able to create the reports yeah like that like that we have application architecture will be there even though with the help of reporting tool directly also we can able to connect to data bases and then we can able to create the reports but uh, the main advantages of this etl process is we can able to clean the data very clearly and uh, on top of clean only clean data we will load to data warehouse then only we can able to create the reports then only we can able to create the report okay so here we have front end team will be there and uh, programming team is there database developer team is there etl development team is there reporting development team is there here these many number of teams are available in the project okay so in this particular case also front end development this is not our part this is not our part no need to involve in this particular part in the project in the programming development also no need to involve in this database development also no need to involve in the etl process also no need to involve here okay and uh, our main part is our main work is reporting part with the help of looker bi tool we can able to create the reports with the help of visualizations with the help of visualizations we can able to create the reports by using reporting tool i will show what type of reports we can able to create with the help of reporting tool okay see here some covid report is there very easily you can able to understand or not tell me so these are all the total number of corona cases in india these are all the total number of deaths these are all the total number of recovered people are there and 99 percentage of recovery is there one percentage of uh, death is there one percentage of death is there and uh, if you move the cursor on top of visualizations this graphical representations very easily we can able to tell see here daily new cases this is the corona wave one and this is the wave two we all are also aware about right so in the corona wave two only like three lakhs four lakhs corona cases are came per day okay like that we can able to see the corona cases also like whenever we will move the cursor automatically it will display the data we can able to understand the data very easily okay and also so with the help of visualizations we can able to showcase the data very easily very easily we can able to showcase see here how the reports are available here so with the help of diagrammatic representation so this will be the total active quarter so this will be the, for example total sales okay total uh, quantity okay like that type of data with the help of visualizations with the help of visualizations we can able to see here total orders these are the total number of orders average order sale price this will be the 30 days repeat purchase okay number of first purchases like that we can able to showcase the data very easily with the help of visualizations by using reporting tool called as a looker bi tool by using bi tools we can able to showcase the data very easily we can able to showcase the data very easily okay so like that we can able to showcase the data so can anybody tell me out of this complete part where is our part where we need to involve in this one reporting process exactly reporting process only we will involve that front end part programming part database development etl part that is completely taking care by other teams only our role is only reporting only no other parts no need to involve okay so like that can able to develop the reports with the help of looker bi tool with the help of graphical representation like this type of reports we can able to create then only users can able to access very easily so now tell me with the help of this visualizations easily you can able to understand the data or not here yes yes so with the help of a diagrammatic representation easily we can able to easily we can able to create the reports and then we can able to share the reports to the 
users. We can able to share the reports to the users. We have different different tools are came into the market also. Like uh, this BI tools came into the market in the year 2000. At that time, SaaS BI, SAP BI tools are there. So the SaaS BI and SAP BI tools are there. Very complex. These are very complex tools, okay? These tools are very complex tools, okay? So for development, for working also very complex only. To overcome that one, Microsoft came with the MSBA tool in the year 2005, okay? And uh, again, Tableau came into the market in the year 2010 in the year 2010. Later, our BI came into the market in the year 2015. And uh, Looker BI came into the market that um, work activities and everything also came into the market in the year 2020 onwards only. This Looker BI tool is there, okay? If you learn the Looker BI tool, maximum we can able to mention in our resume, maximum like two plus years of experience only we can mention. For example, you have some five years of gap is there also. We will mention this Looker BI tool only two plus. Remaining part we will mention some other technology like SQL Server like that we will mention. So for two plus years of experience, there is no expectations at the time of interview as well as uh, there is no expectations at the time of project also. So easily we can able to learn and we can able to sustain in the companies, okay? We can able to sustain in the companies also, okay? And uh, one more thing here related to Looker BI tool, very easily we can able to, very easily we can able to uh, work with the Looker BI tool. And also I will give some features of Looker BI. Features of Looker BI. Okay, this is a Looker BI, okay? This is a Looker BI from? Looker BI tool from Google, okay? Google. So Looker BI tool from Google, okay? Google company, under that Google company, if Looker BI is there, so will you trust the Google company or not? We can trust. We can trust because Google company is a very big company. If they are developed one tool means, uh, then definitely everybody also will trust because if something worthy is there, then only that Google company will do, right? So this Looker BI tool is from the Google company. Looker BI tool is from Google company. And also, and also, it will support cloud applications. It will support cloud applications. Means especially database will be the BigQuery database and Snowflake databases it will support, okay? Google is the, I mean, Docker BI tool is from Google as well as it will support especially cloud applications, the BigQuery and Snowflake. And some other details also will add um, Mr. Keshav, please add some other points here. Yeah, Looker is is completely in the cloud. Here we no need to install any softwares. Looker is completely in the cloud. No need to install any softwares in our local systems. Okay, and Looker supports more than sixty six databases. Looker supports more than 66 databases and Looker BI. Basically, we, we can call it as Looker BI. BI stands for business intelligence. And this tool is belongs to Google. So we can also call it as Google Looker BI. Business intelligence and also Google Looker BI. Why? Because this tool is belongs to Google. So we can also call it as Google Looker BI. And look in Looker, there is more advantage features is there. 
using uh, we have looker apis using apis we can automate the process we can automate the process using using apis and looker supports embedded analytics looker also supports embedded analytics apis embedded analytics and front end technologies like html css uh, react js angular js javascript python java everything everything will support for looker if you want to write any script by uh, using that script if you want to automate the process you can do it using java python css html anything anything can work under the looker okay and <clears throat> and also the ad main advantage uh, google's uh, looker supports git git is a version controlled system and using git we can store our code inside the inside the git repository and we can reuse that code whenever we want and if we have 100 developers also 100 developers are working in one project using git we can easily interact with 100 developers and we can easily see that uh, code from 100 developers so what what the code they implemented and how the functionality will work like this there is a multiple uh, multiple advantages is there this is the high advanced bi tool in the market this is the high advanced bi tool in the market so no need to worry no need to think about more this is the advanced and this is from google so auto, uh, this is the default tool right now the default tool for Google uh, is uh, Looker. Looker is the, is there any reporting tool for Google means right now Looker only. Looker only the reporting tool for Google right now. And uh, go for Google, BigQuery is the, is the default database. Okay. And there is a multiple advantages are there. And right now uh, just 2023, onwards uh, google started to versioning in that looker and 2018 they uh, they acquired from looker okay uh, uh, you, you you can see the you can see the nokri portal also there is um, thousands of jobs are waiting and if you know no one is knows more about looker and we are from last one year onwards we are working with looker and we we introduced more than 12 batches up to now and we introduced more than 40, 40 jobs around the world. Okay. Our people are there. Okay. This is for, from my side. You can see, you can see there is 63,000 jobs are waiting for you. If you learn uh, in the better way, you can easily get the job. Okay. Go ahead, Dwinky. Thank you, Keshav. And also, guys, so this will be the information related to Looker BI. These are all the advantages are available these many number of advantages are not available for some other reporting tools also okay so automation we can able to do and also no reporting tool will support git okay version control only local ba will support the version control the main advantages is at a time multiple peoples can able to work on top of a single worker and can able to complete so that is the main advantages of so git version any point, Keshav? Uh, no, I, I, I'm sharing uh, on word file what are the topics we will cover. You just uh, open it and uh, I can explain. Yeah, sure. Are you sharing in the chat box only? Mm, yeah. Yes, please. Guys, this will be the advantages of the for Looker BI tool and also, and also, I will give the brief information about the local BI course details also once again. Okay. Later, I will share the what will be the uh, index means what are all the topics we will cover in the local BI course level. Okay. Tell me what is our course name? What is our course name? Local BI with SQL Server. Local BI with SQL Server database. Okay local BA that will be the SQL server database with the local BA if you want to work with the local BA we need to learn the SQL server part also our course name is local 
VI with a SQL Server. And uh, as part of training, what are all the things we will discuss is SQL Server contains uh, two parts are there. That will be the SQL and the TSQL. And uh, it will take uh, 30 hours of time it will take. Uh, and these are all the live classes are there. These are all the live classes are there. And uh, Looker BI around uh, it will take 25 hours of time it will take. Uh, these are also live classes only will be there. Completely all are also live classes only. And um, if you join this particular course as part of training, what I will provide, what I will provide in this particular course is 10 things I will provide here. Those will be the uh, record, I mean, required softwares for course. What are all the required softwares we want to install and we need to practice for those required softwares also I will provide. Just now also Keshav said for Looker BI, no softwares are required. That softwares are not at all required for that particular. Looker BI is a completely cloud, no softwares required. Okay. Yes. For cloud yes. side, applications are not required. For SQL server side, we need to install some software that I will provide the software. Any point, Keshav? Yeah. Uh, if we have Gmail account, we can easily interact with Looker. Exactly. Have, yeah. Uh, Looker is cloud application. No software is required. Gmail account. With the help of Gmail account only, we can able to work with Looker BI in the cloud application only. Okay. In the cloud application only, easily we can able to um, work. And uh, next point will be required softwares we will provide for this particular course and also live recorded sessions also will be shared and here two parts are there right sql server classes are there as well as looker bi classes are there these sql server classes are recorded sessions i will upload in the google drive you can able to access the sql server classes from the google drive and uh, looker bi related uh, classes those will be shared in the uh, group itself only those classes are will expire in three days so you need to complete the recorded session within three days only suppose today morning class is completed within next three days you need to watch the session you need to write down the notes and you need to do what are all the activities you want to, okay within three days okay live recorded sessions we will provide and also real-time scenarios also will be explained by Kesho at the time of class itself only um, in which scenario so on so topic we will use uh, what type of scenario they will ask in interview point of view like that also he will explain clearly like interview questions and uh, how we need to explain project explanation also will provide and uh, interview tips and tricks sample resumes resume preparation guidance mock interviews and hr q and a these all concepts also will be explained in this course duration level and uh, we are providing 10 things right so what we are expecting what i can expect from your end is two things i am expecting those two are daily tasks in looker whenever kesha will give some particular task means you need to complete that task and you need to post in the whatsapp group itself only okay in the same day and also and also weekly basis notes also need to send weekly basis notes also you need to send for example monday to saturday class is completed then in saturday evening or sunday you need to send the what will be the that last week notes will be there that notes you need to send to keshav okay so that will be the these are all the two parts you need to do from your end and also if you want to practice this Looker BI, of course, Looker BI not required any softwares. If you want to learn this SQL server course, you need to some laptop configurations are required. That laptop configuration is Windows operating system must be either 8 or 8.1, Windows 10, Windows 11. Better to use the Windows 10, that is better. And also RAM, 8 GB RAM is required. And ROM is, hard disk is 250 GB. Uh, this is required in case in your laptop having 4 gb ram is there already then if you go to the 
laptop shop then you can upgrade another 4 gb ram then it will work fine and also key course details are key course details are course duration we can able to complete the course in 40 days from today day to next 40 days course will be completed and uh, class timings are in this 40 days both looker bi as well as a sql server both are also will be completed both are also will be completed and uh, class timings will be class timings related to looker bi related to looker bi morning 7 am to 8 am class will be there looker bi class is morning 7 am to 8 am will be there and uh, sql server class at uh, 8 30 to 9 30 class timing is the uh, 8.30 a.m. to 9.30 a.m. From tomorrow onwards, from tomorrow onwards, SQL server classes will start at 8.30 to 9.30 after one week. Like today is Monday, right? Next Monday onwards, looker class also will start. 7 a.m. to 8 a.m. looker class will be, looker class will be there. 8.30 to 9.30, that will be uh, SQL server class will be there. Okay, next like SQL server class will be there. Next to 25 hours, uh, looker classes will complete. Next to 30 hours, SQL server classes will be completed. And uh, coming to the course fee details, course fees is 20K and that need to pay in two installments. That first installment need to pay in first installment after demo plus four classes. There is demo session and you can listen next to four classes. And if everything is fine, then you need to pay the first installment and uh, second installment need to pay after local classes. Local classes, once 15 classes are completed, then you need to pay the second installment of the course fee. Second installment need to pay after 15 days. Okay. And, uh, and next part is no class. When we don't have any classes, that will be the Sundays, there is no class. Sunday, there is no class. Okay, and uh, salary expectations. If you have three plus years of experience, then you can able to expect a 10 to 2 lakhs package. And uh, if you have four plus years of experience, then you can able to expect a 12 to 18 lakhs you can able to expect. And uh, if you have five years of experience, then you can able to expect a 18 lakhs package. Last two days back only, two, two people got jobs on top of Looker BI. Uh, one girl got 15.6 lakhs package and another guy got 16.5 lakhs package. Okay, just uh, three, four days back only. Okay, and that offers got. And also, uh, the highest package in our institute till now is 28 lakhs package. Okay, till now, our institute got 28 lakhs package is the highest salary for Looker BI. Okay, and this will be the salary expectations you can able to easily expect. And also one of our student last two, one and a half month back, he expected a two lakhs package, but a company provided 18 lakhs package. Okay, so that type of demand will be there for Looker BI. And also just refer for our course SQL server with Looker BI. If any of your friends interested, please tell them to join in our course. Okay. And uh, related to contact details, if you have any questions, any doubts, you will get uh, uh, today or tomorrow or in this uh, entire our course journey also. Mobile numbers are 974236-9296. It's mine. And uh, I will teach the SQL server classes. And this is the 8310861170. This is Keshav number. He will teach the Looker related classes. And... Uh, 9886442211. This is our institute contact number. You can also able to contact or call or message also. Okay. Better to in what better to message in WhatsApp. That is a uh, quick response we can able to give. You can call our WhatsApp and also you can able to call our WhatsApp also. Still, if you have any questions are there, you can also email to us. That will be the connect at the rate of successpathacademy.com. You can able to email me. I will give you the reply, okay? So from past 50 minutes onwards, like uh, 10 o'clock session is started. Now time is 10.50. Almost 50 minutes you are listening very carefully. 
thank you very much guys now if you have any questions now you can ask me okay so if you want i will give brief uh, information also our course is sql server with docker bi and as part of training we will complete sql server and docker bi sql classes it will take 30 hours docker classes it will take 25 hours as part of training we will provide required softwares live recorded sessions real time scenarios interview questions project explanations interview tips and tricks sample resumes resume preparation guidance mock interviews q and a sessions what we are expecting from you is daily tasks you need to complete and also weekly basis notes you need to complete and also what are the laptop configurations are required is windows 8 plus ram 8 gb rom 250 gb and the key course details are course will be completed within 40 days and also need to pay course fees 20k in two installments there is no classes in sundays okay salary expectations easily we can able to expect from 10 to 18 lakhs 20 lakhs like that we can able to expect as of now in our institute maximum um maximum package got is 28 lakhs as of now okay and uh, if any of your friends interested you can refer you can uh, call or message to these two numbers and can able to join into the our course if you have any still any questions you can able to send the mail also so this is the just to overview of the course and almost 50 minutes onwards you are listening very carefully thank you very much guys now if you have any questions you can ask me ask me any questions are there adi seshash asini hemant madhu reddappa sultana sunil sayed any questions are there a laptop ram configuration 4 4 4 gb ram only suppose sir uh it is fine but uh, if your laptop it will work very slow okay okay if you go to the one laptop shop ask them i need one more 4 gb ram that will be the around 800 to 1000 rupees if you go to the laptop shop and if you upgrade from 4 gb to 8 gb then laptop performance will be the good then easily you can able to practice clear upendra okay sir sir any real time project in mujhe sir definitely real time project will be there once a course got completed and real time classes also will be there that will be the uh, 3 to 4 classes will be there real time classes completely real time uh, what will be the currently kesho working that project only he will show and also in the course level only he will give the some tasks also that will be the real time related tasks only those are one project means that is one report meaning here because we will create the reports by using bi tools okay he will give the tasks also related to in the in the classes itself only that you need to complete and then you need to post in the whatsapp group okay. real time project also he will show 3 to 4 classes sorry which is the best tool is compared to tableau uh, locker is best uh, best competitor to tableau good question see locker on that tab yeah, yeah. yes go ahead keshav yeah go ahead fine okay tableau tool came into the market in the year 2010 power bi came into the market in the year 2010 and uh, that locker bi tool came into the market uh, almost 2020 this will be the generations uh, these tools are came okay so this locker bi is completely completely cloud based application completely cloud based application and also we have many number of features are there we have many number of features are there related to related to this uh, locker bi like it is a google product we can also assume how the tool will be there and also uh, we, it will support to bigquery or snowflake related cloud databases also it will support to, and also sql related dialects it will support to 60 plus dialects it will support and also and also the main advantages are uh, locker api will, will be there with the help of any application also you can able to interact with uh, with the help of this locker bi we can able to embedded with uh, this locker bi also like uh, any dot net or java any applications also can able to integrate with uh, this locker bi and uh, this locker bi supports automation 
and also it will support git okay it will support git okay git means a version control system with the help of this tool we can able to collaborate with all team members at a time we can able to develop the applications okay these are all the many advantages are there compared with some other ba tools and also for example power bi is there power bi is there power bi contains 250 plus visualizations are there so 250 plus visualizations remembering those all visualizations and everything is somewhat very difficult only but uh, in case of looker bi those many number of visualizations are not there within limited number of visualizations only like 20 30 visualizations only we can able to fill all the requirements also that much of that much of flexibility is there in case of looker bi but coming to the power bi having 200 plus functions are there but looker bi having very less number of functions only we can able to work very easily the like that we have more number of advantages are there in case of looker bi and one more thing whenever some new thing will come automatically old related peoples will migrate to new one right generally same thing right suppose some new new operating system came in your mobile so you will use old one only or you will upgrade to new one new one definitely we will upgrade to new one what are the new features are there those new features are peoples much more interested to use right so similarly also most of the companies ask from power bi to looker bi from tablet to looker bi from sap bo to looker bi they are migrating their projects related to reporting side so we have more number of uh, vacancies are there there is a lesser uh, com competition is there because most of the people also don't know looker bi is one reporting tool like that and also there is no expectation also here because maximum we can able to mention in our resume also like 2.6 years only maximum we can able to mention in our resume so easily we can able to crack there is no expectation at the time of interview there is no expectation also at the time of working also because of the age of the tool is max two and a half year three years only so easily we can able to sustain in this technology hello yes madhu Actually, when I checked in Google, it is showing that it was founded in 2012. Yeah, exactly. You can fetch also no issues, but that time that is not popular also. That is the development stages from 2012 onwards to 2020 also. That will be the development stage and that is not that much popular. Because of more number of features, Google is acquired from local company. Yes, in 2019, right? Yes, 2019. 2019 to 2000, 2020 February only that uh, uh, acquisition is completed. Okay. So one more question. Uh, uh, actually, uh, first I was not there first ten minutes. Uh, we we are using for in Power BI Dax language, right? Here we we need any language required for this. Good question. No, no there is no Dax functions and all. There is only few functions that also max to max 50 functions are there. But using those 50 functions, you can able to write all the DAX, uh, how how you will write in the Power BI DAX. You, by using these all the functions, you can easily implement the code. There is no much more complexity. Uh, if, if you know about SQL language, if you know, uh, you, you can easily understand LookML language. Looker language is LookML. The backend, whatever the code you will write the backend code automatically it will take as a sql language and if you know about sql you can easily learn looker there is no complexity and most of the people knows 99 percent of people in the software industry everyone knows about look uh, sql so using sql we can easily interact with uh, we can easily uh, develop multi uh, more visuals so that is the reason this looker is populating more and uh, demanding is more Nope. Yeah. See here, local backend language is LookML. That LookML backend language is SQL only. So that is the reason why first we will discuss the SQL server classes. We have SQL related classes at 30 are there. Okay. And uh, remaining part of local BI part will be there. So that will be the, so if you learn SQL, easily you can able to learn the local BI and easily you can able to work also. Guys, any other questions? 
here there is no limitation in the in the data set if you have the crores of records also you can easily interact if you go for any other bi tools there is a multiple limitations with the data here it is completely in the cloud and there is no limitation okay exactly no data limitation here yes good question your name is real me <laughs> yes, <we> come in. <laughs> yeah, you uh, can rename from next class onwards yeah. no data yes yeah, sure. yeah, is there any is there any question still you can ask sultan sunil sayed upendra hasini something she is asking um... hello sir yes upendra yeah. సార్ నౌకరీలో లుక్కర్ బిఏతో పాటు ఈటీఎల్స్ క్లౌడ్ కంపోజర్ లాంటివి అడుగుతున్నారు అది కూడా నేర్చుకోవాలా నో 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 నాట్ రిక్వైర్డ్ డేటా ప్రాక్ అలాంటి నాట్ రిక్వైర్డ్ కరెంట్ మార్కెట్ సిచువేషన్ ఎలా ఉండాలి మామూలుగా కాల్స్ ఎలా ఉన్నాయి మీకు నో నో నీడ్ నో నీడ్ ఇఫ్ యు నో అబౌట్ ఎస్క్యూఎల్ అండ్ లుక్కర్ దట్ ఇస్ మోర్ ఎనఫ్ హలో ML is asking more, right? Uh, in the nursery, uh, how many hours are covering? How many? How many? Out of 25 classes in the class. Hello? Hello? Sorry, can you repeat? Can you repeat? Yeah, out of 25 classes. Yeah. Am I adequate? Yeah. Yes, yes. So out of 25 classes in the class, so look at ML is so how many hours are covering? Because if you see no career, all the photos, so look at me, it's a must. Right? Yeah, of course. Everything will cover. I, I shared in the, in the chat box, I shared the topics. Uh, Venki, you can open it and I can explain those on that. Yeah, sure. I said join late because I was... Uh... Yeah, you can, you, I can, I uh, will cover all the topics. Whatever the related to looker will cover all the topics. See, these are all the topics will be covered uh, looker architecture uh, in the user guide uh, create connection in database create model file create project and uh, what is parameter in looker and uh, types of parameters just a second types of parameters these are all the parameters and the field parameters join parameters explore parameters these are all the model parameters and create views explores model files so these are all the concepts we will be covered okay so keshav great great this one yeah for earlier batch you you are not created this type of thing yes yes these are all the concepts we yeah. will cover and somebody is asked uh, how many classes will be there related to lookml see guys from here onwards lookml will start okay lookml means that will be the back end language from here onwards lookml will start okay means on an average from fourth session onwards lookml will start from fourth session to up to 25th session in between on top of lookml only we will use okay okay that actually if you see the job description is the camera is the must at least the reporting side visualization can manage somehow that is because we are back on some reporting yeah, it, it's simple language it's simple syntax and all uh, it's no need to worry you can easily learn within a two days thank you okay fine any other questions guys any other questions sql looker be parallel ga cheptaru sir good question and uh, see here looker classes will start from monday onwards means today is monday next monday onwards looker classes will start from tomorrow onwards as usual sql classes will start sql classes will be there at 8:30 to 9:30 that will be the one hour session from tomorrow onwards 
today's demo session. Tomorrow onwards, uh, live sessions will be there from 8.30 to 9.30. Next to Monday onwards, next to Monday onwards, that uh, uh, local classes will start at uh, that uh, timing also I said, right? That will be 7 a.m. to 8 a.m. What you said is correct. That will be the parallelly it will happen. Next one, next one week, only SQL. Next one week onwards, one hour local, one hour SQL. Uh, one more thing. Actually, uh, I know just basic SQL. Okay, just basics means in selector comments in a joint uh, little bit we know, but if we are in actually begin beginner stage SQL. Okay. In this course, we will completely know at least intermediate stage, uh, beginner to intermediate level. The end of the course. Yes, you can as easily you can able to get that much of knowledge also. And one more thing here, as a looker be a developer, and not require the advanced concepts like views indexes stored procedures functions these types of concepts are not required sql and tsql these are all the two concepts are there as part of training level we have sql and tsql these are all the two things are there mainly as a looker ba guys you need to focus you... on sql part and, uh, we will cover... oh, which you going to yeah, but we will cover entire SQL. Definitely. No need to worry. You can learn. Okay. I will, I will share you the index for uh, SQL part also for tomorrow's session. So then you can able to understand clearly. Yeah, so fine. SQL we will. Yeah, 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 fine, fine. Thanks. Okay, fine. Any other questions, guys? Then it is fine. Any questions? Can we download the recorded session for the only? Guys, SQL classes will shared in the Google Drive. You can able to access those sessions anytime also. Those will be uploaded in the Google Drive only related to SQL questions. SQL recorded sessions. Keshav, related to Looker? Related to Looker, there is only three days. Uh, you can able to access those video in that video and uh, there is no download option. Guys, uh, if you listen this session properly, that is enough to learn the local BA. That much of easy will be there local. So still, if you want to go through one, one time or two time, within the same day, you can able to complete and you can able to write down the notes. And uh, and also, Kesha will type the notes also in the session itself. At the time, same itself only, you can able to write the notes also. So easily, you can have uh, one day is enough for learning one hour session, simply. Guys, any other session? Any other questions? Tomorrow class for tomorrow class, another link or the same link to will use for joining? I will share that SQL related link uh, today only. So that will be the different link. I will share you that one in the group. Yeah, yeah fine. So those who are there here, total 11 members, all are there in the group itself. Anybody missing in the group? Which group? Dinesh, something is there, that group or your award? I mean, WhatsApp group. Yeah, we are there. If are. anybody, you can, you can take the number from the screenshot. You can take the photo and you can message us as well. We'll, we'll, okay. we'll add in that group. Yeah. Yeah. Vinky, you can you make it Zoom. Yeah. Yeah, you can take this phone number and... Uh, you want you can take the pick also this phone number you can call after also any other questions guys okay guys we'll meet on okay guys we will meet on tomorrow morning hello? at hello? 8 30 yes well, i'm uh, from different background even i do not know about skill Madhu, if you don't have any knowledge related to SQL, if you have mm -hmm. some knowledge will be there, you can also forget completely about that SQL knowledge also. 
from the scratch onwards we will start we will discuss in the classes you can able to learn from the scratch onwards from the okay. basics to advanced concepts we will discuss easily you can able to learn okay thank you some people telling i have some basics in sql if you have basics is there you can forget that also you can come with a empty mind from tomorrow onwards from basics to advanced concepts you can able to learn so once the sql classes are completed easily you can able to write the sql queries so up to that much of knowledge you will get in the 30 sessions of sql server classes okay guys thank you very much we will connect on tomorrow morning at 8:30 am